What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Thanks for tuning in to the Cold World YouTube channel. Today in this video, we're gonna take a quick look at a Strider Knives DBL. This is a DB. The handle is the same for the DB. The DBL is just longer. The L means, I guess, stands for long, longer, long. L, long, right? Makes sense. So the DB is a little bit shorter, the regular DB. This is the way it comes. This is the Monkey Edge uh, exclusive with the um, the 3V, CPM 3V steel. So it comes with this Kydex um, sh uh, sheath or holster or whatever. Sheath, not holster. What am I talking about? You can put this on your belt here. It's got this Velcro deal. That's cool. Let's take a look at it. It's a Tanto, of course, Tanto Point. It has the uh, Monkey Edge logo right there because it's an exclusive. Um, the knife is not exclusive to Monkey Edge, just this particular um, combination of blade steel with their Monkey Edge frag pattern grips. That's what they call them. So you could buy these grips separately from Monkey Edge if you had any other uh, DB or DBL knife and um, install those. But uh, the 3V is specific uh, Monkey Edge um, exclusive edition. So these are, you know, they're pretty, they're hard, they sell out super quick when they get them in stock. Um, just, you know, 3V Strider on one side and uh, 3V, check it out. I'm like totally roasting my finger right here, you know, this thing is dull as hell out of the box. This part right here is not sharp. It's not supposed to be sharp. I mean, the tip is a little pointy. Like, obviously, I could stick it through my hand if I really tried. You know, it, it punctures quite well. It's kind of sharp right there. But this uh, front tanto point right here is not sharpened. It's, it's not sharpened to a razor edge because... You know, this is actually like a pry bar type of tool. This isn't like, from my understanding, this is not a purpose-built, like, uh, defensive fighting knife. It can be used as such, but more or less a prying tool, kind of a, you know, all-in-one just knife and pry bar and just a tool. So... This part is not sharp, so that way you could do some scraping or prying, you know, with the, the thick uh, tip. So, this part here is extremely sharp, the rest of the knife. So, that's cool. Uh, you know, you can see how it fits in the hand. The handle is, you know, good size, I guess, for a full-size man hand. Um, medium to large I would say it's not I don't know the ergonomics are good it's got nice jimping nice deep choil so you could really slam it into something your hand will not slide forward with that deep choil there and that that jimping is done quite nice all the edges on the knife have been knocked off so there's nothing sharp or harsh on your hand and it really excels in the reverse grip with that that typical slanted edge like you see on most Strider knives like a SNG or SMF or XL or Stub they all have that angled you know back shape but feels really good in the reverse grip right there just read a little bit about the specs here about the DBL is one of the best selling fixed blades uh, originally designed by a police officer that needed a hard use tool a hard use tool that was part pry bar and part knife could be pressed into any roll that was easy to carry on duty, belt or vest. For those reasons, it has found favor with military and LA guys as a small go anywhere, do anything type knife. That's what it says. And uh, the 3V steel is basically indestructible, in other words, to sum it up. And let's just go over the specs really quick. On this sucker, the overall length is going to be uh, 
Overall length is going to be 8.25 inches. The blade length is, I believe it's measured from here because it's a fixed blade. Not like a folder where it would be measured from the hinge. Anyways, I can't really tell you exactly where that blade starts. I suppose it would be right there. The blade length is 4 inches, it says. On the, I'm reading the specs. The blade thickness is... <laughs> really thick a quarter inch thick exactly or 0 0.250 inches yeah that's a quarter inch the cutting edge length is 3.75 inches the weight without the sheath is 8.2 ounces half a pound right and the handle scale is g10 and the sheath is Kydex. So, there you have it. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And stay safe. Peace out.